this problem we have gallium that has a <coughs> freezing point of uh, so the freezing temperature or temperature of fusion is equal to 29.8 degrees C and it has a molar enthalpy of fusion of delta H fusion of 5.59 kilojoules or kJs per mole. It then asks what the value of delta S is when we have 60 grams of gallium uh, solidifying at that temperature. Now this hails back to the, an equation that I showed you in a separate video that says that delta S or change in entropy for any uh, physical process is going to be equal to delta H or change in enthalpy and fu of fusion divided by T. A couple things you have to know is that this has to be in joules, not kilojoules, and this has to be in kelvins. Has to be. So our delta, our, our temperature fusion is 29.8. I add 273.15 to that, and that will give me how many kelvins that is, and that comes out to be 302.95 kelvins. Yay! Now, uh, I need then to con uh, take this number and this amount, 60 grams, and somehow do something to it to get joules out. So let's take our 60 grams and then we'll remember that uh, there's some kind of atomic weight of gallium. I've got grams down here and moles up here. One mole of gallium weighs a certain amount. We can find that on the periodic table. Fortunately, I already did at 69.7. You'll notice that the grams cancel each other and I'm left with moles, but I want to eventually get to joules. How can I do that? Well, I've got this number here that has kJs per mole, so I bet I could kind of use that. I'll go 5.59 kJs in uh, one mole for gallium. And then I want, of course, to get to joules. The moles cancel each other out, the grams cancel each other out. But I'm still off with kilojoules, so I'm going to have to put kilojoules in the basement, joules in the numerator. Remember that there are a thousand joules for every one kilojoule. That all cancels everything out, and I'm left with units of joules. I do all of that, plug and chug in my calculator, and I end up getting 4,812 joules as the total number of joules that 60 grams of gallium would uh, require in order to make this change. So, I've got this as my delta H fusion. That's uh, the, the numerator. My temperature is, hang on, <laughs> yeah, my temperature, my temperature is this number. There we go. Temperature fusion is this. That goes in the basement. My delta H effusion is this in joules. It goes in the numerator. I throw those numbers in there, and that should give us the delta S uh, for fusion for this uh, amount of gallium. <laughs> ah.